It is time. I have collected all of the Infinity Stones, all of the greatest packs in the game for this moment. What's going on guys? Come here back again on another MLB The Show 19 Diamond Dynasty video. Today, we are going to break the game. We have three SIG packs. We have four set 25 headliners with Jose. With tons of more and including set two finest players. This has all the makings to be a bona fide slobber knocker and I'm all here for it. Now, technically, I don't need any of the finest players. I already got JT Ryumuto, but we have a brand new 99 Anthony Rendon. Tons of new 99s in the game. 111 contact versus righties. 107 contact left. 93, 106 power. 112 vision. Gold defense and 53 speed. This is a very solid card, and he's going to win MVP over Yelich and Ballinger too, baby. 98 Arsenal LB switch hitting second baseman. 125, 111 splits versus left-hand insane 112 vision gold defense once again 80 speed i really wanted to use i think his player of the month card last year it was going for like 200k for like an 87 overall card f that but i definitely would be interested to get this card now and finally or last of the rare tier we have a glaber taurus he is only 22 Glaber God comes equipped with 92, 97 contact, 109, 102 power, 96 vision, uh, not gold defense, silver defense, which uh, hopefully should be good enough. But offensively, this card is amazing. Man, if there's one thing I never get tired of, it's blowing all my stubs on packs. Oh, could you please leave a like down below? I'd really appreciate it if you could. And I mean, well, you're just sitting there if you're not subscribed, you might, might as well hit the button, you know? baby just an umami of explosion in los pantalones with all these packs so many diamond potential opportunities let's go ahead and get these worthless packs out of the way first i don't think it's possible to pull a diamond out of here so yeah okay let's actually start the pack opening now we only have 20 of the show packs this time we don't have too many of the regular degulars but we have a lot of the special decilers I swear, if somebody who's new to my channel, they probably don't even know if I actually speak native English. We finally get our first gold player. We get an Andrew Miller, so 13 packs in. We finally get something of somewhat value. Okay, maybe it was a good thing that we didn't open too many of these shell packs because those, those were bad. Gold player pack right here. Hopefully we can get something, some sort of value. Lucas Giolito, that was eventful. Okay, but now we're gonna get into the meat and potatoes. Let's start with these legend and flashback packs. There is, I believe, a 1 in 10 supposed opportunity at a diamond. Let's go ahead and try this one again. We get a Steve Cheese check. I have a feeling I know what's gonna happen right here. Rich Gossage. I still have these tops now September packs. I think there's some decent cards in here. I guess not. They're all pretty cheeks to be completely honest with you. But I don't care if it's cheeks. I'd rather get a cheeks diamond than a butt crack gold. Oh man. I don't know what's going on with my packs right now. Wow. I'm just getting really bad vibes. We finally get a diamond right there. Sound the horns. Blow everything out of the proportions. Six RBIs. How the hell is this a diamond? Who the hell is this a diamond? Negative one board. What the? F <clears throat> How does this guy have a diamond? You're telling me this guy is worse than anybody else. If I put myself on that team, I'm better than Kevin Newman. Okay, but damn, he goes for more than quick sell value. So even though you're detrimental to your team, you're not detrimental to my heart or my stub wallet. So for that point, I appreciate you. Let's try one of these headliners. If we could possibly pull Raleigh Fingers My Horse, that would be definitely good. We still have three more opportunities. I'm really looking for a diamond out of a headliner. So let's go about damn time. It's been a hot minute. 145 home runs. I'm not too sure. If this is Jose Reyes, I'm going to be very, very excited. All I need to see is the New York Metropolitan, baby. All I need to see is that city field. Oh, that was embarrassing as hell, but who cares? We got Jose Reyes number seven. I already have you, but that's just additional stubs. Listen to that vibration. Woo! Oh, god damn it. 60,000? Uh, it's a little light. That is more, but damn it. That's 60,000 I didn't have previously. Let's go! 
Now that's what I'm talking about. That is the kind of pull that I expect from headliners. It's supposed to be the top of the billboard. You're supposed to be excited, not go away having depression and suicidal thoughts afterwards. Three more show packs, we get another gold. We're pulling every damn net, which isn't a bad thing. Um, except if you look at the fact that they didn't make the playoffs, then yeah. We are down to just a few more packs, but we're guaranteed seven diamonds out of the rest of this. Let's go ahead and open this monthly award pack. We have a chance at another Met. Hopefully we do not get a week. God, we get the base round. Kind of unfortunate. We're definitely not picking a damn giant. Uh, yeah, let's go with the Rays. All right, we're going to bring out a special friend to open up this pack right here god damn it he can't even fit in the seat now this is going to be very difficult to actually try to press a button if you're wondering why there's a giant stuffed bear in my house don't question it okay i'm gonna try my best we're gonna do a signature back. pack we actually got it to open well that wasn't so good let's go ahead and open one of these headliners and hopefully that can Change our fortunes. When did Carlos Carrasco, the cookie man, get downgraded to a silver? My man's had cancer. He was diagnosed with leukemia. What the hell? That, no, that's disrespectful. Fine is set to tons of good players. Really no bad ones, but definitely some favorites I have. And we get the top tier. Let's go the upper echelon. That is going to help me out tremendously. Damn, I don't even know who I'm going to pick. Hmm, the Yankee is going for the most. Does that mean I'm going to pick him? Hell no! You think I'm about to pick a goddamn Yankee? Give me Anthony Rendon. Super happy to have him on the team. Let's go! Okay, this is turning out pretty dandy, if I do say so myself. Last headliner pack right here. We got Jose Reyes. I really can't complain all that much. So we can get the rare tier in the finest. Can we finally get a rare tier in this one? No, I cannot. I don't know why my sick packs are so bad. Every damn time, it's just the base. Uh, it says Arsenal goes for the most, so welcome back to my team for a very short stint. I'm talking about a Frodo Baggins length stint on this squad. You getting sold right- Hell, actually, you know what? I'll take this off right now. Ah, we get the base now. That's not the worst thing in the world. These cards are actually really, really goddamn good. Um, and I don't think we even lose all that much. I think they're all going for about 20 thou wow. So at worst, we lose about 5k, I guess. Uh, they're all going for pretty much the same. We'll go ahead and get the Garsas. Man, I'm nervous. These cost 35,000 and I'm not trying to get another 6k card. You know what? Just open it. Go yeah. ahead and show me. Are you serious? How? Every single time. Not one failure. We always get the base round on these cars. You know what? I could be wrong. You know, I'm just, uh, give me Keith Hernandez, okay? I don't really care. Hopefully these are still in the store, and of course they're not, so I can't show you all the odds. Now, here we go. Squint if you must. Mid-tier is one out of four. I probably opened at least ten of these, and I think I've only gotten one mid all the others are base. Tell me how those odds make sense. Uh, spoiler alert. They don't. But it all could be better if we get one more uh, high tier finest. Uh, wave the white flag. There we go. Once again, I don't think it matters. We're just going to go ahead and pick Chris Bryant. We tactically pulled so many diamonds. It was kind of absurd. But to be fair, they were kind of all guaranteed too. Well, I guess let's go ahead and round them up. Ozzy Smith goes for 10k. That's better than expected, so 10. Pirates, we had Kevin Newman. Has a negative war, but positive in the stubs. That's 21,000. 21k, make that another 21. 42k with Chris Bryant. Not bad. We only lost like 4k off of these base tier rounds on the finest. If only I could say the same for the sig packs. And here's the big and Jose race going for 83,000 plus 42. Oh man. I think it's 125k. I'm not completely confident with that. We also got two Keith Hernandez, which 8.5 times two carry the nine is going to be 17,000. So 125k plus 17 is going to be 142. 
alongside the Mitch Garver, which is 162,000. So technically, I think we're going to walk out with more than we came in. But to be fair, I had three of those signature packs, which cost an astronomical amount. 35 times three. I'm done with math. You guys can figure it out for yourself. Well, butter my biscuits and call me Belitnikov. I forgot we pulled the Anthony Rendon. I don't remember how much we had, but add 62,000 to that number. Okay, you know, I was just about to be sort of melodramatic, but I think this actually was a somewhat successful pack opening. I mean, have I seen better? Of course, I pulled two trout within one box. Of course I've seen better, but this was not bad. I'm not disgusted. I'm not going to go blind after having witnessed these events. I'm just going to have a little trouble see. Go figure, the pack I always talk shit on, the headliner pack, we finally pull something good out of, and the signature packs, once again, we get shellacawapped. As always, let me know down below in the comment section, how have your packs been? If you opened up the set two finest, did you get the base round? How did you guys do? Let me know down below in the comment section. If y'all enjoyed this video, if you liked the goose, gaffs, and laughs that hopefully you obtained within this, let me know by leaving a like down below, and also, subscribe if you guys are new. But with all that being said, hope you guys have a great day today. There comes out. Love is love, and hate is hate. To die is an awesome adventure, and I can hardly wait. Earth is a prison, I need a great escape. You know I'm in my zone when I'm up in outer space. You know I'm in my zone when I'm up in outer space. You know I'm in my zone when I'm up in outer space. You know I'm in my zone. You know I'm in my zone. I took a bite of the glory.